Hi, my name is Ken German, and I'm an international business consultant, and I help people create successful, highly profitable home-based businesses. What I want to share with you, since I'm a technology geek, is I want to share with you how you can use Google Image Search to find scammers. Now, this is good for people that are just when it's a little fishy to actually go out and do an image search just to verify their identity and if you find that their that their picture appears under more than just one person's name it's a huge red flag and you just should just run now I use this and and you, I use this when I was in the international dating scene before I met my lovely wife to go out and search on images and then find out whether this person is legit and when you're in the international dating scene a lot of times what will happen is they'll post some picture of some beautiful sexy model and thinking that you know you're an idiot and you'll never you'll never use Google image search so what I'm going to show you is you can go out to Google image search and this is actually one that happened to me this morning and I'm not saying that this the, the, the Paul Houston here is a good buy or a bad guy but the evidence is, is pointing towards him being a scammer and I'll show you how I found that so I'm going to click on Paul's picture here on Facebook and I'm going to right click on his picture here I'm going to say copy image location I'm using Waterfox, which is another variant of Firefox. And I'm going to go over here to images.google.com. Okay? And then this little camera thing that's here on the images search, you click on search by image. Not a lot of people know about this, so this is why I'm producing the video here today, is I want to educate you on the power of the Google image search. It also helps to protect your identity as well because you can do a search on your own images to verify that nobody else is using your image as well. So what you do is I just I did a right click and I cut and pasted that image location of the Facebook photo and I did a search by image. Now if this guy contacts me again I'm going to send him a link to this video I'm going to post on YouTube because this guy isn't very is very obvious that this guy isn't Paul Houston and I'm not trying to say anybody negative or not but I want to make sure that you can use this tool to protect yourself so you can see that the evidence here is that it's a Polish politician and if you do a further search on this guy's name you can find pictures of him with his children you can find him in also sorts of political events if you scroll down farther you'll see wow there's like a lot there's a Twitter pro profile with this guy's photo on here there's a, like and actually you can get a little search and there's lots and lots of things out there in Arabic and different languages it's it's apparent that this Paul Houston guy is not who he says he is and I would never ever and this is your first red flag if they're from Nigeria and I'm not saying that Nigeria is a bad country but that's like the the whole you the whole universe of scammers is in Nigeria so again this is how you use Google image search to protect yourself Ladies and guys, you can use this on dating sites for somebody you're kind of suspicious of or even you just start meeting. It's a cheap, free way to start protecting yourself from scammers. Again, my name is Ken German. I'm an international business consultant, and I help people create highly profitable, successful home-based businesses. Have an awesome week. Hope that you enjoyed this training.